The ODAC Women's Lacrosse Championship featured the top two teams in the conference. Number two, Rona College, at number one, Washington and Lee. The Generals have dominated the conference for well over a decade. The Maroons trying to change that today. It started out overcast at Watfield and Lexington as the Maroons and Generals got set for battle. Back and forth game early off the free position shot. This is Grace Katusis muscling one home for the 2-1 Roanoke advantage. But here come the Generals at the other end. This is Walker. McKnight out like a light, finding a seam and scoring that goal. WNL led 4-3 after the opening quarter. Second quarter, wraparound opportunity for Hannah Bishop, and she zips one in for the 5-3 lead. Five goals for her today as she reached 200 career points. Generals building separation later. How about the classic give and go? Works in basketball and it works in lacrosse too. Ali Schwab finishing this one. 6-4 is your score, but Grace Katusis trying to keep the Maroons in it. Another free position goal. She scored four Four times today, but WNL proved to be too good around the net. Just before halftime, Jenny Lashovich falling away from the net, but somehow gets it to go as the Generals go on to win the ODAC championship 16 to 9. It's the program's 13th consecutive conference title while they get the automatic bid to the NCAA tournament. The Maroons are expected to get an at-large bid. In the ODAC baseball tournament, Lynchburg beat Bridgewater 11-1, forcing a game three that will be played Monday at noon. Reno College eliminated WNL with a 4-1 victory. Maroons will be one of the four seeds to play next weekend. And in the ODAC softball tournament, Virginia Wesleyan beat Randolph-Macon in an if-necessary game 2-1 to win pot two. Reno College claimed pot one one after beating Guilford 3-2. So the Maroons and Marlins will battle for the ODAC title in a best-of-three series beginning on Thursday. 